Right. Tonight, Eyewitness News investigates dozens of soon-to-be pharmacy students are in limbo after the area's only pharmacy college has to reapply for accreditation. The news comes less than a week before school starts. CBS 47's Dennis Valera shows us what students need to know. 2014 is when California Health Sciences University in Clovis welcomed its first Doctor of Pharmacy students. It was going to welcome its newest class on Monday, but due to the program losing its pre-accreditation status this week, it won't be welcoming new students anytime soon. This is happening because the college fell short in three key areas required to keep pre-accreditation. In California in particular, there's a new designation for a pharmacist, the Advanced Practice Pharmacist, that has a larger scope of practice and they can actually even prescribe a limited set of medications and enter into collaborative practice agreements with physicians. This affects 44 students in total that were planning to start on Monday. In a statement, CHSU's president, Florence Dunn, said they're making sure they don't miss any time in their education and are trying to get them placed in other colleges. We have already contacted other California pharmacy schools who will be interviewing these students this week. We are committed to helping these students in any way we can to help them transition. Second, third, and fourth year students will still be able to finish their program as well as take their licensing exams. CHSU hopes to start admitting new pharmacy students starting fall 2022. Now, it is important to note that this does not affect CHSU's College of Osteopathic Medicine, which just welcomed its inaugural class last month. Dennis Valera, CBS 47, Eyewitness News.